What's up everybody on YouTube? How's everybody doing? I'm doing just fine. Doing awesome actually. So today, welcome to a building tutorial. Yes, a Minecraft building tutorial. Yes. Um, I'm very excited to bring you this little house. Uh, this little hut even. Uh, it's, a, it's a unique style I have. Um, I don't usually get to show this off because, well, simply... It's not a common style I use, uh, but, you know, hey, I'll show it off to you anyways. <laughs> um, I, I built a house, a bigger version of this kind of house on a uh, server that I was on. And uh, this house, this little hut, I came up with it, come, came up with it on the spot. Um, and it's pretty cool. Um, I really like, what I really like about this house is the, the front of it. It's just got a nice feel to it, nice warm atmosphere. Uh, especially with the shaders, but still, you know, it's got the nice, like, uh, warm entrance feel to it. It's got these glowstones on the side um, that are really nice. I think they're a lot better than the wait, well, torches, uh, and they suit the house very, very nicely. So, uh, if we, you know, come on in, we got a nice little double doors here. I love the entrance, as I said. It's nice, you know, nice little circular kind of entrance. Uh, kind of like a hobbit hole in a way, but you know, not really, because uh, it would be in the mountain. But this is kind of like a little hut. But we come on in, and we got our nice little utilities off to the side here, our little anvil crafting table and whatnot. Uh, over here, we have our nice uh, enchantment table and so forth, our nice little bed. Uh, it's just really nice. I love the uh, interior because you come down and you step down. It feels like you sink down into the house, but you're actually going down one little half, going a half slab down. And, uh, but that really makes a, a difference in the build, um, instead of it have being all half slabs and then, you know, uh, building on top of that. Because that's originally what it was going to be, but I sunk the side parts down, and I think it looks okay. I think it looks nice. Got a nice little flower pot here, too. Can't, can't forget the flower pot. Hmm, so beautiful. Yeah, but anyways, so we're going to be building this house today. Uh, let me just get my building materials, and I will, uh, well, we will get building. Okay, so as far as I can see, this is pretty much all the building materials you need. Um, I, I can't really... I, I thought there was going to be a lot more. It looks like there's a lot more, but there isn't. This is all you need for this house, or this little hut. I keep calling it a house, but it's actually a little hut. Uh, but yeah, so I'm going to build right next to it, because I'm actually not sure <laughs> how to build this. Um, uh, by heart. So we're gonna just going to... We're going to build right next to it, and that'll be fine. Um, so I'm going to start placing like these nice little little things down. I'm just going to copy the house over. Actually, you know what? We'll start from the entrance. How about that? How about we start from the entrance? Let's do this right while it's going. Let's do it right. So, um, we, we place down these nice little slabs like this. Top half slabs, you know, this, the good stuff. And, uh, we place them in this kind of shape. You, you, gotta, you got this shape. You, you pro builder if you watch my channel. And we'll place some, uh, stained clay. Uh, the, it's, this is the lime stain clay. Actually, for this house, you can use whatever stain clay you want. So if you have a different preference um, to what you want to do, actually, I think I'm going to use a stain, different stain clay, just to you know, kind of show how um, how you can do that. So it'll still be the same house. We're just using the same clay. Don't you worry. Okay. <laughs> so I'm going to put a nice some red stain clay there. You can do whatever you want, as I said. Um, and uh, now I'm going to do like a nice little uh, entrance kind of kind of feel. So I'm going to place two stairs like this, and then we're going to go with this. We're going to use spruce wood here. You don't have to do this. You don't have to use the a different kind of wood. Uh, I just use a different kind of wood because it breaks up the uh, the uh, you know the plain old oak wood. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to place just a nice little circle. This 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 shape going around uh, all the way. So. Basically, it's just going to be this, and I'll show you it in its finished state. There we go, and that's pretty much the the circular part there. It's just these two stairs kind of uh, facing each other in uh, opposite directions there. So we're going to then place spruce stairs in all the corners, and then we're going to place spruce slabs up. Oh, spruce slabs <laughs> up top there. There we go. And then what I'm going to do here is I'm going to place some um, uh, some logs going like that, and then my stained clay going around all the way like this. And there you go. That's the entrance so far. 
And I really do like the entrance as it is. You know, it looks pretty cool. I'm going to take out these corner bits and we're going to add some oak logs going straight, straight across like that. And we're going to place a slab on top of that, I think. I think we're going to place a slab on top of that. Yeah, we, we are. And then we'll place some oak logs going like this. And there you go. There's your entrance so far. You can place whatever type of door you want to place. I actually think I'm going to choose a different type of door just to show you. You know, you know, you can use whatever building materials you want. And there you go. Now I did try placing them in the other direction, like this, and uh, that doesn't eh, it doesn't look too good. I don't think. Uh, so we're gonna just going to keep it like this for now, and I think that looks perfectly fine. Um, yeah, I like this. This is coming along great. All right. So what we're going to do now is we're going to get our glowstone out. We're going to place that right there. I'm gonna place that right there, and we're gonna get a nice little, you know, topper on top. You know, nice little, uh, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> uh, and we're gonna place this, um, this the, the nice little bottom part there on uh, on the glowstone. And we're gonna cap. We're gonna cover it all up with the nice little trap doors on a glowstone, as you do, as you do. And I'm gonna place a log behind that, going all the way up uh, to the t to the stair there. So be like that. And we're gonna place a slab on top of that log, the log post that you just did. Oh, <laughs> and there we go. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side. All right, so now it's coming along pretty nicely. We're gonna place a stair just to kind of cap these all off down at the bottom here, underneath your glowstone. And uh, yeah, then we're gonna start doing that little, um, those little uh, kind of supports that we were doing. Now these are little wooden supports, but for a hut, you don't really need. Um, the, the you know the wooden kind of uh, you'll need the stone and that's what I find what unique about these houses you don't need the the stone supports all right so now what we're gonna do is is I went ahead here and I put the uh, supports in already uh, don't follow this house follow what I'm doing over here um, I'm just looking over here on occasion just to see what's uh, what's going on now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go up to the same height as our logs with our, you know, kind of like a U shape with the stained clay that you have chosen. And I'm going to put spruce wood. I want to use slabs here, but you can use, um, you know, the full block. And I'm going to go here like that with our spruce wood, and that'll make our side walls beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Looking good. And now I'm going to mimic what I did on the bottom here and just do it on the top. So I'm going to go up here and place these stairs going like this. Okay, not too complicated, right? Not too complicated. Just the mimic, just mimicking. And that kind of creates this nice little rounded shape too to match the front. I'm going to do the other I'm going to do the other side as well. All right, perfect. Now, now what we're going to do is we're going to place a log just like we did on the other side here. We're also going to put a nice little slab on top of that, like we did on the other side. And we're going to do the same thing here. Beautiful, beautiful. Now what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to place some stairs on top of here, like this, on either side of this spruce wood right here. And I'm going to place uh, two spruce slabs, and then I'm going to place an oak slab here, and then an oak wood log there. So pretty simple, we're going to do it on the other side. As always, you can always rewind these videos just to kind of get your own little little uh, little tutorial going and the speed that you want so you know you can always like slow it down or whatever um, and rewind the video and uh, now what we're gonna do is is I'm gonna place two upside down stairs just like so beautiful and then do the same thing on the bottom here now we have to do the back all right now we have to do the back we're already at the back this is amazing <laughs> this is going so well um, now we're gonna place two uh, oak, oak logs just like so. Don't do what I just did right there. Do, you know, you're just gonna mimic what you did at the bottom and the top. And then we're going to make like a kind of like a circular shape with our um, with our nice little stained clay just like so. So let me stand back, take a look at that. You copy that. Copy that. Got that. Roger, roger. Over, over. And then we're going to take our nice little oak wood over here and make that beautiful little window I was showing you earlier. Yeah, 
Um, and now we got to do this. Well, did I show you that little window? I don't know. Maybe I didn't, but it's beautiful. So there you go. <laughs> and we're going to mimic the uh, supports that we were doing earlier on the back side here, right in the middle. And this looks. This is going to make the build look really, really cool. All right, so place your oak slabs just like that. And then we're going to do a nice little oak wood like, like we did over there in the back. And uh, yeah, that's going to start bringing things together. Now, we're going to place oak slabs, upside down oak slabs, just like so. So we'll do the same thing here. Alright, and there you go, there you go. Looking good. Now we're going to place stairs. Oh my, more stairs. I know, this building has a lot of stairs. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to place some oak stairs facing this way. And some oak stairs over here doing the same exact thing and on the back of that I'm gonna do some spruce wood stairs and uh, let's see here what I'm gonna do here I'm gonna do another little spruce stair facing in like that with its big old face when I say face I mean like the little the face whatever the, the face of, I don't know <laughs> god dang it uh, well, yeah you, you get my point and replace glowstone in the middle of that and uh, yeah that's your building done believe it or not that's that's it that's that's all of, that's all of it done. No, no, you're not done yet. Shut up. Shut up. You're not done yet. Go into your house and go do some work, please. Um, <laughs> so, uh, yeah, you come in here. Take out all your grass that you just, you know, made a mess of. Make a nice little strip of oak, oak wood, uh, you know, slabs going like that. And we're going to take out and do full blocks there, kind of. You know, you can do top half slabs, whatever you want to do. Whatever's cheaper in your world. Um... There we go. We'll just do see how I did that. Um, yeah. <laughs> so now we have this full block down here where we can place stuff. And we have this slab kind of here um, going across like this. So we're a little bit above our stuff. But uh, it's the perfect level with this window. It's the perfect level with the door. Yeah, it just works out perfect. So now we're going to get our lovely building stuff. Get it some chests. Oh, God, get out of here. We're going to get some interior design stuff. We're going to get our house pimped, our hut pimped up, and it's going to be amazing. It's going to be wonderful. So we're going to place some chests like this. You can do it however you want to do it. It doesn't matter. It is your. It is now your build to carry on and live as a legacy throughout the whole Minecraft year. Um, and we'll get an anvil. We'll get some more necessities, right? So yeah, there you go. There's your utility section already done. That's amazing. Easy, simple as pie. And uh, you can place, you know, in your enchantment table, you, maybe you want a bookshelf. I don't know, it's up to you how you want to do your interior. It's pretty simple because you're limited to these, these two sides and you have the, like this nice little walkway. So it's really whatever you want to do. Nothing too complicated about it. And place your ender chest here if you're really advanced in the world. And then what you could do if it's a little dark, it's a little dark, you place a torch here. Place a torch here and there you go. No mobs will spawn. Because, you know, uh, you got these slabs here and you got extra lighting. Um, you got some lighting up there. Now what you could do here, for interior work, uh, you could make like these nice little arches with the slabs. Uh, this is pretty much all you got to do, is just kind of uh, place two full blocks, a slab here, a slab here, and a slab here, and there you go. You got a nice little uh, interior, um, kind of like molding of some sort, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, you do whatever you want, really. Okay, so now we got, we're got. we going to place some... Let's make this a little nice. We're going to place some trapdoors like that. And there you go. Pretty nice, right? Pretty nice. So yes, this was the tutorial of uh, the small little survival hut. I don't know what I'm going to call it yet. I never do until I name the video. So uh, yeah, there you go. And they look cool next to each other, I have to say. So you, ha you can have these like a little village. And you can have them like around like the little town. Uh, all different colors. Uh, maybe you want to make one that matches your personality. Um, I don't know. Whatever you want to do, you can use whatever colors you want. Um, just feel free to use this in the, your world. Uh, you don't have to give credit to me. But if you want to, that would be great. And uh, tell them where you got the tutorial from. Show your friends and share this video with, you know, all your friends and stuff. And say, hey, look at this cool little survival hut if you want to build it. So, yeah. <laughs> As always, don't forget to be awesome. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.